Welcome in then to the latest edition of Extra Time. Thank you as always for your questions. Ali Moreno is with us. We also welcome to the show Luis Garcia is here, as is Frank LaBeouf. But we've got to start with what's going on under the table. <laughs> with you may not see. Be, be, be very be able, specific. Which you won't I'm not sure we're going to with see. This. Don't worry, HR. Uh, <laughs> Come on, Shaka. Oh. Get him out. Oh, here we look, go. Look at this. Hello. Look Hello. At this. Look at them bad boys. boys. Are those tapping shoes? Look at no, them this bad is boys. Ballroom dancing. A little, 13, a little velvet on your top. 13 as well. years I've worked with you, Shaka. I've never seen you with these sort of shoes. It's what? like a, a, a patina. It's, it's a patina. It's, you're too late for a midlife crisis. What, what is it? <laughs> I'm just very fashion forward, Dan. Well, very forward. Out of the picture forward. They're very shiny. Bam. I can get you a pair if you like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure I'm not sure I do them in kid sizes. What's the motivation here? I'm I'm <laughs> Did you just give up? I'm just hold on. Uh, 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 come, uh, no, other way, oh, other way. Look at that. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh. Tapping shoes. Oh baby. Look at the oh, dancing. Look at the velvet. Look at the velvet. Oh, look at velvet. Is, oh, is that velvet? Oh, oh yeah. Wow. Shaka, velvet I, have, I have the same. Shut it over. You have the same. Yes. Yes. Do you want me to bring in some? Do you want me to bring in? I'm, I'm, try, I'm trying with these two, Frank. I'm trying. I, I am, but I'm feeling miserably. No culture, no culture, no style. You know, Venezuela and England. Yes, no, no style. Hey, that's right. Hey. That's right. Frank looks like he's Easy. just gone to a country club and they made him put a blazer on. <laughs> What's going on there? Wait, put your shoes up. No, put your I'm shoes good. up, Dad. Well, my shoes are just scattered. <laughs> 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 Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. Some uh, dancing shoes, Shaq. Luis, obviously. Oh, classic. Yeah, handsome. Good. Classic. James Condes. Yeah, classic. Ah, yeah. uh, classy. <laughs> but Top injured. Neck. Top turn neck for Luis Garcia. There you go. Classy. Classic, but injured. Uh, yeah. Injured. Classic, but injured. <laughs> 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 we, learned, we learned during the show today. Uh, Luis playing Liverpool against Celtic. Did his car thing. <laughs> that was after a lot of very stray passes. <laughs> uh, how was it playing alongside Steven Gerrard at Anfield again today, Luis? Uh, well, actually, I, I, well, I was there. Yeah, I played. I played. I'm gonna say that I played. <laughs> I was gonna say that I was there. Sorry, being on the pitch. <laughs> being on the pitch, Steve. No, it's always a pleasure. It's always a pleasure. I think that uh, these kind of games are great for us. Uh, be back to Anfield, the atmosphere, always for a great cause for the League of Full Foundation. They help a lot of people and catch up with the legend as Steven Gerrard. We got the Kenny the Glitch. We got Skirt to do a right to. Also for the game, Riera, Momo Sissoko, Fabio Aurelio, all the guys. I think it's just fantastic. And Stevie, you know, it's always special. He played for the 90 minute and uh, he's still feed, stick and run, stick and smash the ball. And today score a goal from the penalty spot. So it was fantastic to catch up with the skipper. And Maka, Maka was there as well. No way he lasted 90 minutes. He'd be in the bar after an hour, I reckon. <laughs> after, I have to tell you that I was surprised. After 20 minutes, he said, listen, Yes. I can do yeah. my <laughs> 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 He didn't think that was before the full time whistle. <laughs> uh, uh, that's for sure. Oh, nice one. We need to get Stevie over for one of them. Uh, uh, what, what do you want to do to Stevie? Oh, <laughs> oh goodness. <laughs> Maybe you have a GoPro on his head. <laughs> oh, <laughs> It'll go like this. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Sally Hamner Hamner. Hamner I've noticed that Ali no? is saying, uh, Cole? Uh -huh. instead of Cologne. Okay. Calling Bayern against Dortmund, the Klassiker. Uh -huh. And talking about a vacation in Freiburg along the... That is very <laughs> Okay. <laughs> okay, first of all, that's the... Uh, that's it. Badisha Weinstrasse. Yep, so Whoa, that's what, that's what what? what? Who are you and what have you had done with Vamos Venezuela? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, classic. I'm, I'm, I'm di classic, diversifying Ali. the profile, wait, wait, the you, portfolio. You're going to Germany in the summer, yeah, on holiday. Well, yeah. I actually yeah. am going to Germany, France, and Switzerland. Oh, which are you more excited about going, Germany or France? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more excited to go to... Ah, I like it because it's going to be on the western side of Germany, eastern right. side of France. Oh, I'm going to be right there. Oh, lovely. Yeah, on the Alsace region. Oh. Yes. What, what can you tell us about the Alsace region? Uh, we don't have the answer. We don't have the answer. What does he prefer? To go to in Germany or to oh, France? Oh, 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 well, we'll, we'll, see what, we'll see once I go on the trip. I'm going to go to Strasbourg. I, I've, I've been told that Strasbourg is really nice. Colmar, I'm going to be there as well. What is wrong with oh that? Oh my God, you picked the right <laughs> places. See? 
You see? No, 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 Ali, Ali, I have to tell you guys, I lived five years in Strasbourg. Colmar is one of the be most beautiful city in the world you're going to see, with the little, as we call the Venice. Mm -hmm. But give me a call, Ali, I will give you some good names for restaurants, ah, for sure. Oh, yeah. see? You're going to yeah. enjoy. Yeah. yeah, Frank said that to my mate who was going to Paris, yeah. gave him an Italian restaurant to go to. <laughs> well, great. <laughs> 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 Thank you very much. Hey Luis, it's not. <laughs> well, you know, well, your friend, your friend is, your friend is either English or American. You know, I'm afraid to give him a French restaurant. I'm not sure he's gonna like it. Well, so I go um, for, you any, know, I... something more casual. Just, just for the record. Yes. And officially, just to make sure that we're very clear. Yes. On that particular question. Vamos Venezuela! Oh no! I'll tell you what. Hey. Luis, none of these are Ibiza, are they? Let's be honest. You go Ibiza to all these... Not to be honest. No, exactly. Little quaint little town. To no, nice beach, sea, lovely jubbly. <laughs> right, Ben Foster signs for Wrexham. Zlatan back for Sweden. Which member of the panel is best suited for an emergency call-up? I well, know who's well, not. We know Luis is I know who's not. <laughs> Luis has done his card. <laughs> Uh, Frank, worry. Ali, you no, Ali. What do you mean no? We, we know, no. Ali, Ali, Ali can I'm, go. I'm Ali ready. can go. You Ali tell can me. go. I can tell me. Allow go. Yeah. I'll, I'll give you 20 minutes. Yeah. I'll give you a Steve McManaman sort of effort. Do you think? So? Yeah, no. Come on, you've got more effort. Okay. Than <laughs> Fine. I'll give you 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to see Robbo back, just because he would kick everyone. Yeah, it's a lot, of, a lot of anger, bitter. a lot of anger in his life. A lot of that anger. That would be good. I think if we really could catch up to them. Exactly. As starters. I see. Don would be shooting the wrong way. Alessandro. <laughs> Alessandro can do well. Nadum. Yeah. Nadum. 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 Oh, Nadum. Nadum. Yeah. Nadum's yeah. 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 a good name. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. 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 Right then. <laughs> I thought about it. Nadum. Nadum. Look at you. That didn't last 20 minutes. Hey, didn't you see me the last time with Venezuela? How it was moving so well. I my a bicycle kick. Well, it was more of a tricycle, but hey. Okay. Um, well, this is a very personal <laughs> question, but I think we're in an okay position to ask it. Frank, I'm worried that I'm starting to lose my hair. <laughs> Any advice from the man who made it fashionable to be bald in France? <laughs> well, you know. It's funny, it's funny that I was part of a documentary last, w last week about uh, bald people. That was a very serious matter and serious uh, <laughs> debate, you know. Well, you know what? When you start, you know, losing somehow, you know, your hair, shave it. Shave it. You know, no question. Don't try to survive. It doesn't work. You know, just shave it. If you, if you have a good, how do you call that? A good shave, yes. that's going to be okay. It's okay. That's going to be fine. No, that's that's better. That's not that's the least worst, you know, oh, yeah. because we have no choice. So let's go for it. Let's go for Robo, myself, yes, and some others. You know, we tried to fight. It didn't work, <laughs> and we we much happier like that. So Frank, that's good. Tell us that's more good. about this documentary. <laughs> 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 no, that's funny. They called me. They called me two months ago, and they say, you know, we are making a documentary to express, you know, because we realize that psychologically, it's been hard for many people uh, being starting to be bald very young. And it's no man. We don't have the tendency to express ourselves when we have some issues. And that it's true that I was 21 when I started to lose my hair, and uh, I wasn't that happy about it. But I never said anything uh, to anybody, so... so it, it, and they called me and they said, do you want to talk about this? I said, okay, that's going to be fun. And it's funny that some friends who lost hair as well uh, have been part of, a, of the show, of the documentary, and uh, we shared the same thing without talking, because nobody wants to talk about it, because you're... Guys, okay, you lose, lose your hair, what the point, you know, don't talk about it. But it's uh, psychologically, when you... 20 years old, you start your career and you start losing your hair and you look like more 13 than 20, that's an issue. <laughs> I can tell you, that's an issue. So you did the documentary for free, Frank? Yes. Wow. Yes, mm, for the wow. sake of bold people, for mm. the union of bold people. Wow. That's yeah. the first time and the last time. We know Frank does nothing for free. <laughs> <laughs> really close friends. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Now, if you don't follow Luis, and that's true. And that's true. <laughs> if you don't follow Luis on Instagram, uh -huh. this person obviously does. He posts his impressive workouts on social media. Oh, Beautiful back garden uh -huh. in Madrid, mm -hmm. swimming pool in the background. Luis working oh. it. Oh, it's very, very. Oh, 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 hello. Hey, 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 hey,
his legs need a beach. That's how he's putting his hamstring. Hey, the legs need a beach. Very, very impressive. All that to pull a calf muscle. Yeah. Uh -huh. wow. So it didn't work. It didn't work, man. <laughs> All that to last less than Steve yeah. McMahon, man. So it didn't work. Hey, no, honestly, <laughs> hey, we need to take those legs out to the beach, <laughs> please. That's how he got injured. <laughs> how do the guys' workouts compare to his? Who is the most fit? So Robbo, Robbo has a uh, rowing machine, doesn't he, in his garage? Uh -huh. Robbo's we got all kinds of machines. Yeah, it's, I think his rowing machine is like his main toy and he just angrily rows for like 20 minutes. Uh -huh. Robo like, angrily yes, exactly. does everything. Craig, goes through life. Craig, when he's in the gym, puts a towel over yeah. the, um, the cross. The screen, yeah, the he screens, tray, he has no and idea. And just stares yeah. at the towel. Uh -huh. Shaka, you're, you're, you're quite relaxed, I would say, when I've seen you in the gym. <laughs> <laughs> in the gym, it's everywhere. Not, quite a lot of intensity to your work. <laughs> I just make it look that way, Dad. Well, <laughs> it's just a lot of back. No, no, I'm, I just make Backing it look that way, Dad. Uh, Frank obviously has got a penchant for showing himself topless in the gym. Oh, yes, that's yeah. Great. We see, we see a lot of that, yeah. don't we? Ali, your workout I, regime. Voila. I play. I play. I go and train with my 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 son's team. Yes. Uh, yeah. When, when I like when I survive. <laughs> huh? Whether they like it or not. Yeah, I know. Um, <laughs> I know. Kids kids. Yeah. I know. I know. Tough enough, kid. I, there's a lot of talking. Yes. Yeah, I bet. Usually it. from me. Yep. And Stevie has an exercise bike uh -huh. in his basement, which he uses to hang clothes on and mm. such like. Yeah. You, you are a little robo sometimes. I, I see you as being a little robo when you yeah. play it. A little angry. Yes. Well, uh, Shaka, I have a lot of anger in me. And has to come out somewhere. All oh, right, right, <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> I, I I don't want to bring it home. Yeah. Right. That doesn't serve a purpose. So leave it out on the field. All right. Okay. Okay. Uh, Frank. Is what about your workout, Dad? What were, yeah. we, how were we yours? How, how's yours? I'm only little. I've got the hair. <laughs> I don't want to get too snacked. I can't do too much. Because <laughs> then yeah. everything's out of proportion. <laughs> you know, oh, we've, got to, we've got to be very oh, careful Lord. with the guns. <laughs> <laughs> the water um, pistols. Otherwise, oh, ah, geez. Me. Uh, I'm hurt it all. I'm, oh, no. I'm only little. I'm, I'm hurt it all now. I'm, I'm the all. presenter. I don't want to kind of outshine mm, before right, we're out right. doing I don't want the, the broad oh. shoulders. You know, oh, I was yeah, considerate. Sure. Exactly. I'll be very considerate. Uh, it's the continuous criticism, Frank. Let's get back to soccer. For crime out loud, it's a soccer show. Uh, PSG's failure in the Champions League justify in chronological, chronological order, Frank. They went out to Madrid, Manchester United, Bayern, City, Madrid, then Bayern. Apart from United, all of those teams have better squads than PSG. Man City lose to average teams, but get far less heat. So what is the question? It is, <laughs> what is the question? It's the criticism, um, Fair. Is it justified of PSG and their failings in the Champions League considering the opposition? Oh, it's not it's not about the, the, the opposition, it's about how they lost yeah. and uh, the way they behaved around those uh, those um, uh, eliminations. That's what it is. You can lose. You have the right to lose if you give if you give everything and uh, and that day it was maybe a bad day, uh, unlucky day. But it's not that case, you know, when they have the remontada uh, against uh, Barcelona, uh, when they won 4 0 at home, it's because they don't play as a team. It's because they drop too much, because they don't listen to the coach, because they lost, and they suddenly they, they, they explode, and, and that's not fair. Uh, last year against Real Madrid, they have everything in their hands, and they make sure they make a big mistakes. Donnarumma first to, to lose to lose the, the game. So it's all about their behaviors uh, for I would say overall, uh, what, what it, which expresses the uh, the the anger of the fans or the anger of the media or or the the, the criticism of the the pundits. That's what it is. More than the opposition. For Luis, when you went to play for Liverpool. Did you have challenges adjusting, adjusting to the culture, weather and food? Did you already speak English and how do English clubs help foreign players learn the language? Yeah, great question. Actually, yeah, we, of course you struggle uh, with the weather, with the style of life. Um, you, you are used to and you don't know very well in Spain. You go for uh, for lunch maybe at two or three over there. The, the restaurants are already closed at 1.30 and at night exactly the same at 4.30. 
uh, uh, the stores closed, so there is no op opportunity to go for a walk or something. So you need to adapt the style of life to what it is. It's true that you focus a lot on football. Uh, the, the, the weather pushes you a little bit inside your house, <laughs> so kind of you have to adapt very quick. Football, of course, is different. Premier League is faster and more exciting, probably, when you see that the conscious act physically, you have to get better. And because of the, the uh, language, the barrier of the language, is, it was one of the toughest ones because it's true that I didn't speak English when I arrived to, to England. Also, in, in Liverpool, it's special accent, so it, it took me a, a while more to, to kind of understand everybody. And the clubs at that time helped us with the uh, teachers. Uh, they, we had teachers three times a week for one hour around. And then that teacher used to come with us for quite a few periods during maybe six months. So he used to come with you to, to make them, if you have to go to buy the, to, the, to the store, uh, it will help you to go there. You go to uh, buy some clothes, it will go to with you and will help you into, the, into that matter to learn a lot more uh, vocabulary. And at the end, it's about trying to adapt a little bit, but it's true that it's, it's not easy. Also, Rafa Benitez, uh, kind of implemented that you couldn't have lunch in there when we were at the training ground with two guys that were from the same country. So I couldn't eat, for example, with Xavi Alonso and Antonio Nudet on the same table. He wanted us to speak English oh, in wow. all around the, the, the available side. Like an intercambio at lunch. So you, oh, that's interesting. Kind of, yeah. Yeah. yeah kind of. Oh, hey, hey. Ah. Did you just drop intercambio? Well, yes, because they tried to force me to do that. <laughs> <laughs> um, based on the video that we saw today from Luis. Yes. He still hasn't adjusted. Oh, <laughs> wow, wow. Oh, wow. Come on. Just saying. Oh, that's a tackle from behind. That's a tackle from behind. You know, and a striker. Yeah, right. They don't know how to, I, 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 to, to, to tackle. It's, it's I, Louis... I can't say anything, but it's a footage and we've seen it. So that's right. <laughs> it's when Luis gets out his Champions League winning medal. Oh. <laughs> fine, fine. You win, you win, win Luis. You win. You win. Never, uh, never. Okay, never. Uh, final piece of a question. Uh, what has been everyone's worst piece of punditry? For example, Dan said Harry Kane was a one year wonder. Sticking to it. <laughs> 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 and uh, Frank had Canada and Denmark in the World Cup semi-final. <laughs> um, well, and I had Real Madrid, you know, very bad as well. Yes, so. yeah, that's very true. <laughs> so yeah, they made a documentary out of that as well. <laughs> Bald people, Real Madrid people, you're everywhere. <laughs> uh, Shaka, obviously, after the World Cup, your worst punditry has to be changing your mind, isn't it? When Argentina lost to Saudi Arabia. Oh, I do that all the time. You ditched them. Yeah, I yeah. do that all the time. Yeah, that was pretty bad. <laughs> no, I wasn't. What's your worst bit, Pony? Ah, uh, far worse than that, I'm sure. What about the time that you had to commentate Trinidad Tobago and you refused to talk in the second half? Yeah, that was losing? tough. Yeah, that was tough. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've never done a Trinidad Tobago game since. <laughs> you got grumpy. I was so, I was, I was angry. The producer kept going, may I say something? I'm like, no, I've got nothing to say. I've got nothing to say. <laughs> 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 I was angry on here. <laughs> oh. Worst piece of punditry, Annie? I'm trying to think. Um, when, whenever Lukaku and Morata oh, were, yes. when there was the option as to yeah, who, which one? Who yeah, who should go? Like yeah. who should Chelsea go after? Yes. I I don't remember, but I may have said Morata. Yeah. And if that's the case, yeah. my bad. Yeah. Well, it's not like Lukaku has been great either, but no. but comparatively speaking, yes, yeah. Uh, Luis, anything st stick to mind? Every, yeah, I got one, the one, and uh, um, every single time that Real Madrid plays and I bet against them, you know that I'm doing away <laughs> things. Yes. But uh, the big one this season you see, is I'm that not the only one. Eddie Haaland, I was in expecting. <laughs> yes, yeah, you're the yeah, person who Jan always says. You're the one that Jan always says. People doubted Haaland in the Premier League. <laughs> 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 He's going to put your picture to it now. That is it. Oh, fantastic. Well done. That's all right. He hasn't done much. Uh, that's it. Uh, <laughs> one that's season wonder. It. Another one season that's wonder. That's all right. That's all right. Do you want to last, last show your yeah, shoes? Please. Where are you going please. somewhere tonight? No. Oh, hell oh, no. Oh, no. no. Oh, like it's, it's dancing Ooh. shoes. Oh. Those are dancing shoes, Shaq. Oh, it, it, they obviously had the camera down there. Yeah, <laughs> but the, the leg of the table hey, that's blocks some, That's some long legs, Shaq. Now we have to faff and wait for them to get the, the camera. Uh, right. oh, yeah, yeah, look at that. Yeah. Hey, I bought the socks. Ooh. Come for the shoes, stay for the socks. Oh, man. Hello. Oh, the socks. socks got oh. some little flowers on them. Oh, See, but then I got little flowers in my... Uh, oh. In hmm. your... Uh, 
Oh, yeah. yeah Pocket people, square thinking about Bobby. <laughs> well, I can't see them both, but I'm just showing that mm, I match. It's oh, a, really? It's a yeah. night out tonight, Shaq. Wow. What, where are you going tonight? Yeah, where are we going, Shaq? Straight home. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we can go somewhere well. after. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is it. That brings us to the end it's of fine. today's show. Thank it's you very much. Clues. It's my home clues. <laughs> oh, you're off tomorrow, both of you. I am. Yeah. off. Lovely. Mm. Very oh. good. I might go up now. <laughs> Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.